Welcome, welcome, welcome. Welcome in. It's Saturday. I'm Atticus582. I normally focus on all things comic book related, but in honor of avoiding burnout, to be honest, <laughs> and spooky season, we're taking a detour and we're playing some other games. For a, a, any given period of time. What up, Bello? Welcome in. Hey, did you grab that first? Did you grab that first? Grab that first. I don't think anybody's grabbed that first. Not for two days has somebody grabbed a first. So the first is up for taking. How are you? How's your Saturday going in the future? It's like eight or nine there, right? Eight o'clock? 8.30, am I right? Hopefully it's wet. Well, I know it's probably dark because we're getting to early darkness. Ah, I don't like the early darkness. There's an eclipse, a solar eclipse today. 8.30. I'm going to tell you something about solar eclipses. I think the phenomenon is really cool. I think the actual <laughs> action of watching it is quite boring. <laughs> I'm like, oh, this couldn't uh, appeal to me less. Like, I think it's a cool thing that happens, but like just sitting here, like looking at the shadow as like a shadow goes over a light. I'm like, okay, cool. I'm going to go do something, anything, anything else, literally anything else right now. Like, I just want to sit there and stare at the sun and not burn my eyes out and see it, but that can't happen. So, I mean, I know there's glasses and everything, but eh, eh, you couldn't see it. I mean, it's cool that it happens, and I'm not trying to take anything away from other people who enjoy it, but, like, every single time I've watched an eclipse ever since I've been a kid, and I was like, that was really uh, underwhelming, like, compared to, like, the hype of what people give it. <laughs> I don't know. I know. I'm a negative Nancy, but I'm not I'm enough with that, because we've got more Alan Wake to play. Guys, chapter three was pretty freaking awesome, if I don't say so myself. I had a blast playing that. Did that a couple days ago. Ocelot tuned in. I had a blast with Chapter 3. No, uh, uh, you know, high, like uh, moments that were potential soft locks. Nothing like that. Uh, yeah, then Chapter 2. Oh, that was annoying. But uh, Chapter 3 had some awesome plot points and uh, some awesome moments. And uh, I had a genuine blast playing Chapter 3. So I'm looking forward to Chapter 4. We've got 4, 5, 6. We're officially halfway through the game. We're going to play Chapter 4 today. My new schedule, I did change it. Normally it was Thursday. If you did not hear, my new schedule is going to be Tuesday, Wednesday, and Saturday from here on out. Tuesday night, Tuesday evening. Tuesday evening, Wednesday evening. And Saturday afternoon, a.k.a. 8.30 Bellows time. That's what time I stream on Saturdays. Generally. Generally. Glad you're able to tune in, Bellow. Thank you for coming and hanging out. Let's get started with Chapter 4. Not at all. Let's get started with Chapter 4, shall we? Oh, we need to turn up the volume. 8.30 is perfect. I agree. 8.30 is perfect. <laughs> Episodes. We got to go to the truth. Let's do this. We'll get a little recap of what's happened in general as well as what happened in, in uh, Chapter 3 if you were not here. But uh, God, this game's really good, guys. I'm so excited for Alan Wake 2. Couldn't be more excited for Alan Wake 2. It, I may be honest to God. I know this is blasphemy, Bello. But I may mo I may be more excited for Alan Wake 2 than I am for Spider-Man 2. I know that's blasphemy, but it's true. Here we go. Episode 4, The Truth. Don't let me forget the title of this. Every time I go to make uh, the the video for the chapter, the, the VOD, I'm like, what was the name of the chapter that Please I just played? on Alan Wake. I'm hunted by the law. Sheriff, Wake's running. I'm giving chase. Are you seriously telling me that writer just took out my I know, Bello. Don't hate me. Is coming true. I'm very into the this game, though. The story seems and to this be story. Shifting. 
It's turning into a horror story. I was told that Alice had been kidnapped. Except that for a while. Why. It'll come out on PC in a while. But yeah, to begin we with. To the start with. The kidnapper was eaten up by the dark presence before it attacked me. Yeah, at least much. The truth. Alan. Shh, baby. We fell into it the water. Just a nightmare. No, it wasn't. Alice. There you go, Alan. Hartman, I fell. I had to give you a sedative. I don't and trust you, Hartman. You went through another rough period. What? Right now, it's very important that you stay calm. We don't want you to have another episode. You're a patient at my clinic. Have been for a while now. The shock of your wife's death triggered a mental illness. Wife's no, death! You're, you lie. You're suffering from various symptoms of undifferentiated schizophrenia. Bastard. It's okay, Alan. Just Very good purchase. Very good purchase. I'm excited to watch you play those, if you play them. If you play them. On stream, I mean. I felt groggy. I whatever Hartman I, I, I know what you mean me there, numb. Al. I felt like this was happening to someone. If else. not, I know someone you'll enjoy them regardless. I couldn't think, couldn't focus. All right, Al, let's the roll. Door was locked. Oh shoot! I was a prisoner here. They locked me in. That's not safe. Let me out. I guess I'll just write. Good evening, oh. Alan. Oh. Are we feeling better now? Feeling calm? Hartman? Yeah. I'm gonna I beat the crap out of you. Gorilla with you. So sure, I'm calm. I get the message, loud and clear. Why, right. That's the spirit? You're being very brave, Alan. I understand you're confused. Hey, Alan? I would be more concerned if you weren't suspicious of me. I don't blame you for it. Big of you. Now, Bigly. You come with me. We'll reacquaint you with my clinic and go over everything you might have forgotten. Guys, Spider-Mans are so good. Some fresh air? I'm excited. Yes, I, this, it I mean, it's not good. to say I'm not excited for those games. I very much am. But, like, just right now, I'm just very hype on Alan Lake. This corridor is for I'm sure when Spider-Man actually drops, right I'm going to be now, super Jack excited. Took them out for a fishing trip, except for the ones who are particularly vulnerable, of course. I encourage creativity as a part of the recovery process like here at Cauldron guy. Lake Lodge. I specialize in treating artists. I bet you do. Splendid, Alan. I honestly believe we can get this thing under control if we work together. There's nothing to get under control, Doc. I'm fine. Look at me. This way, Alan. Look at me. That's the face of somebody who's A-OK. -okay. I don't want to get in that elevator with you, sir. Okay, let's go. Can I hit the buttons? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. B, B, B. Now, Alan, from past experience, I'm going to go see a movie tonight. I need to get right into the heart of the matter as quickly as I can after an episode. So I'm just going to say this. Alice is dead. Don't no. you say that. You're in a very vulnerable state until you understand and accept this. Don't you say Alice, that. You take that back. And you couldn't face that. You're suffering from hallucinations, paranoid delusions unusual thinking, an obsession about light and darkness, a feeling that everything revolves around you, your thoughts and dreams. Hartman, I'm gonna your kill you. Mind has constructed an What's wrong with your nose, Hartman? Did I do that? Which your writings are affecting reality. She has been kidnapped and supernatural forces of darkness are trying to stop you. We go this way, Alan. I wasn't ready for another shot, so I went along with it. He had to be lying, but under the influence of the drug he had given me, I had to fight not to believe his words. It's all in your head. You At least we're in the pretty up. place, right? Apart from the Am I right, Doc? Your wife, Doc? No one has been killed. Doc, answer your me. Doc, are, are we in the pretty place? Your Doc, mind Doc, shut up about my dead wife for a moment. Painful. Just tell me we're in the pretty place, please. We fight the Doc, fantasy, it will Doc, return. this place is really pretty, I right? Know the instinct is to resist me, but <sighs> doesn't this make far more sense than the insane Too much business talk. Not enough. This is pretty mind? place talk. You're a skeptic by nature, Alan. We both know this. Hartman, you're such a downer, dude. Logically. 
No wonder why no one likes you. You need a makeover, Hartman. Fantastic Beast? I've never seen it. I've only I've ne I've only ever never seen Well, I'm going to tell you a secret. I've read all of the Harry Potters and I love them and I think they're very good. I only made it through 3 of the movies. Tired of this view. <laughs> very inspiring, isn't it? Cauldron Lake spread below us. I can see Mira Peak on the Ow. other side of the lake. I thought I could make Dribbled out the spot where Diver's myself. Isle had been when I arrived. I know, Bello. I know. Now there was nothing but waves. <laughs> Don't hate me. It seems there's a storm coming. Funny, I don't recall there being a mention of that in the weather forecast. Well, well, uh, look, it's upon us now because way, you wouldn't talk me. about how pretty it was, and now God is mad at us. Alan, what I'm telling you is good news. I love the books. Right now we're in control. I just couldn't get every into the movies. A relapse, it gets more and more difficult I was like, everything that's happening on the screen is not what I had in my head. Considering your profession, <laughs> and I'm like, what I had in my head was with. way cooler. After all your nightmares, this should come as an immense relief to you. If it doesn't, why is that? Because I'm lying? Or because you don't want to admit that you're not well? It's oh. very natural for I, you. I very much recommend. Hi, Layla. Part of the I let him talk. All, Hartman I sure did. Loved you're his a saint, Al. His words echoed madly inside my head. But I, I dug my nails into the myself. palms of my hands to stay focused. You need to work with me. Once you accept that... We can begin the journey towards your recovery. Come along. Let's go in. We have to take a break from Harmon. You ever go outside? Talk to them. Talk to them. Say hey. Say hey to them. Say hey, everybody. Say hey. Put. Yeah. You gotta go outside? Let me let my dog outside. I think you just got to go outside. I'll be right back. Okay, we're back. And she did absolutely nothing of what I asked her to do outside. Did you? Absolutely nothing. Yep. That's all right. That's all right. Oh, I should go. I need to go turn off the TV in the room. Because it's streaming. I will tell you this, the weather 
is actually very pleasant for the first time in months. Oh my god, it's so nice. It's so nice. It's perfect weather. Well, here's the entrance to the office wing. That's for staff only. You were impressed by my trophies when you first arrived here. I was. I do love to hunt. The great outdoors. Quit gaslighting me, Doc. Versus nature. It's wonderful stuff. Pretty damn wonderful, yeah. Hey, who are you? Scary, scary, scary. Rain. <laughs> That's pretty cool. Emma's. I wish it would rain here. <laughs> Want me to punch this guy, Doc? Dream, I don't know how to punch. Afraid of me. Don't want to run into me in the night. That's for sure. Please, Emerson. Mr. Wake is Want me to punch Emerson if I knew is. how? If I knew how yeah, to throw a punch? Like me to go Alan away, Wake so does not know scared. how to throw a punch. But you can't just decide what kind of dream you have or when you have it. Emerson. Okay. okay. Emerson's got sorry, a point, sorry, Doc. Sorry. Boo. Oh, look at these Emerson. dead animals on your wall. We're actually making some progress with him. I'm happy to say. He works on video games. Video games. Of course, but it does involve some small creative effort, which makes him receptive to my therapeutic methods. No kidding. Okay. Okay. Now, you might have noticed the typewriter in your room. You've been writing as a part of the therapy. As soon as you feel up to it, you should continue. Read. Welcome to Cauldron Lake Lodge. We're here to give you a specialized help you need. However, please observe the following. Please ask friends and family to schedule visits beforehand to ensure they don't interfere with your therapy and or periods of creativity. Also, please respect your fellow patients' need for privacy and personal especially when they're engaged in by their creative process. Typically, be patient. Our typically our patients have long-term creative problems and they won't they won't be solved overnight. Give them yourself permission. That's that's bugging me. Give give yourself permission to, to take the time you need. Bear in mind that you're voluntarily receiving treatment that has been specifically tailored for you. Engagement therapy trademark. And its sister method, the flow trademark. Work best when you are actively engaged and shaping them. If if you have any concerns, please do not hesitate to voice them. Doc, I don't want to do this anymore. You said vaunt. Dude. My rheumatism is killing me. Hey, it's the guy from the desert. There's a storm coming. Oh, what a storm. I hope it wipes this place off the face of the earth. And these two are and the scene. brothers, Odin and Tor. They had a, how should I put this, a heavy metal band in the 70s and 80s called Old Gods of Asgard. They even adopted new first names to complete the image of Viking gods. After the band broke up, they lived on a farm nearby. They are, well, in advanced stages of dementia. They're well cared for, oh, TLC and all that. Okay. There's nothing more that can be done. Well, they like the song on the jukebox. I'm afraid if you play that it for the rock and roll lifestyle has left its mark. No, that won't do. That's I'm right, so Bella. Cut this See, short I tie now. in the, the Avengers into what I'm playing. Up. I'd better go play check bring out. in Marvel. We'll continue this soon. Meanwhile, when you feel up to it, return to your room and try to write. It really is for the best. Look at this man telling me what to do. I'd like to bash his head in with a hammer. Oh, he'd love to fish out our secrets, but he has no clue. He's not crazy enough. <laughs> not crazy like us, Sonny. Yeah! Being ah. crazy is a requirement, Sonny. Who Sonny! Who could understand the world when it's like this? It takes crazy to know crazy. That's the sanest thing I've heard in a while. <laughs> Zane! 
You're all right, Tom. Hey, we like him, don't we, bro? He's got to go to the farm. The Anderson farm. Valhalla! We wrote it all down, lest we forget. A crash course. All you need to know to get your head right. You need to find the message. Here, Sonny, here's something for you. Gave me a rash, but I kept it safe from these bastards. Oh, no, what am I doing? All right, hold on. I got to pause for a moment. <sighs> Where is it? Where is this? Okay, hold on. Hold on. Hold on. No, 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 no. Stop it. Uh, hold on. I'm trying to do something here. Bear with me, all. Oh, the quarry was so good, guys. I beat the quarry yesterday. It was very good. Quarry was very ex. Man, I need to start doing uh, playlists. Okay. Okay. Let's rock and roll. I was clearing up, or according to Hartman. <laughs> I was sinking back into the fantasy. I was convinced he was lying to me about everything. Crazy or not, the Andersons made more sense. Thomas Zane didn't feel the poems taking form, shaping things. As he experimented, he imagined he could almost feel the power surging through the keys of the typewriter. It exhilarated him. Stop Titan Zane. His fear too. If not for his young assistant Emil, he would have given it up. But Emil convinced him otherwise. He too had a way with words. Wow. Okay, let's roll. Tom, got any booze on you? Return to your room. Bye, guys. Yeah, uh, no. <laughs> I gotta go back to my room. Doctor's orders. Stuff at the farm. Doctor's orders. Oh, give me this thermos, y'all. Forgot that I'm hunting thermoses. That's why I'm here. Look, so many thermoses. I unlocked a Chivo. Gotcha. Yo, the doc's I unlocked a Chivo, yo. Here, but holler if they get too rowdy. I'll do that, Birch. Something's Whoa. wrong. Hey, wait. Why don't you humor Dr. Hartman, Hartman and give the writing a shot, huh? Typewriters in your room. Hartman had mentioned that the power had been acting up. There's too much happening. Maybe that was the reason for the generator and the work light on the balcony. The generator hadn't been activated, and there was no key. I saw her again. She's not human. Oh, there it is. It's not human. A dark presence is wearing the old woman's face. She was Look at me. In clinging Freaking shadows. out. There's a hole in her chest where her heart should be. Ooh, that's a I lyric to I a song, a it sounds mistake. like. I don't think I'm any closer to saving Alice. Oh, it's been lying to me, using me to get the story it wants, and the story will come true. Very cool. All right, back to my room. Gotta avoid angering the doc. Hey, where's my room? Wake. Okay. We gotta write. The doctor said I had to. The white glare of the blank page in front of me hurt my eyes. My hands began to shake uncontrollably. Hey, Wake. You stay here. I'm gonna go see what's up. Can I wasn't ever gonna go anywhere. Do. Now I'm thinking okay. about it though, because you planted the idea in my mind. I didn't know what the chaos was all about, but it could be my only chance of getting out of here. All right, out of here. Gimme, gimme, gimme out of here. This is like the lodge and the quarry. 
Thanks for making a distraction for me, guys. Well, things are unraveling fast, aren't they? Oh, yeah, I forgot that I have stamina and it's not very good. Pick up manuscript page. Barry in the lodge. Talking, giving Barry the grand tour, clearly proud of the place. He went oh, on and no. on about his hunting trophies. I think this, uh, Barry was impressed. But he was here on business. Mug he is going bad. It keeps dripping. Hey, Hartman, where's Al? Hartman stopped in mid-sentence, annoyed at the interruption. He nodded at the hulking orderly standing nearby. The man smiled and clapped a practiced hand on Barry's shoulder. Heck yeah, he did. All right, let's go. We gotta go see what's going on down here. I'm taking it. Sinclair Ooh, Emerson. Bad. That wasn't a love tap. The crazy old fart hit her hard. If she was one of Hartman's goons, she had it coming. I had destiny. to get to Hartman's office. He had taken all my manuscript. Wow, pages. you guys found That's your hammer. Come out and face the music, Birch. It's time to pay the piper. They're not happy. All right, Hartman, where'd you go? Is it upstairs? I think it's upstairs. Maybe it is an upstairs. Is there a thermos in here? There's a chair for me to kick. Wow. It's getting bad outside, y'all. No thermos? Okay. <sighs> Emerson. Emerson Cod, the pie maker. If you guys don't know who the pie maker is or Emerson Cod is, you should definitely watch Pushing Daisies. It's one of the best shows and uh, didn't last as long as it needed to go. Oh. Click. Okay. This is him. Barry? Barry's here? Oh, man. I don't want to rescue Barry. Barry? Ow! About time! Barry, man, am I glad to see you. Give me that thermos. We need to get to Hartman's office. After I get this thermos. It's right next door. You okay? Yeah. I mean, no. The cops found me at Rose's trailer, but they didn't hassle me too much. I'm obviously a victim in this, and I demanded to be treated as such. Or else I'd sue their asses. Speaking of asses, that fed gave me a real hard time. But I had no clue where you were. That guy's crazy, Al. But he let me go, and then I get a call from Hartman, that son of a bitch who tells me you're here and I should come pick you up but when I got here two goons clobbered well at least you had my back air. Barry what's what's with the cutout I stole it from the diner to piss off Rose after what she did to us that'll teach her yeah that's a all right all right here we go. oh there's a gun okay time to go These get them bad the guys pages I had on me. and more and more Alan, please. You're sliding back. Hartman, Tell me one more line this is your exit. You in the face. Stage left. Ah, well, it was worth a shot. Really, Wake, come on. Let's work together on this. You have no idea. Hartman, what if I up. say Barry, no? Get out of here. I'll catch up with you. Get a car. Oh, Al, let's just go. Wake, listen to me. This is a mistake. Don't you see? You're the Together kidnapper, aren't you, Hartman? we can create something absolutely wonderful with your ability and my... Oh, no. <laughs> well, now you gone and done it, Hartman. Look at him. He's all happy. <laughs> Oh, we gotta go. We got a manuscript page, Hartman though. Followed the fall of Alan Wake with his binoculars. When the rider hit the water, he ordered Jack to take the boat to him. The spot was easy to see in the dark, even with all the extra lights in the boat. The flare floated and kept burning even in the water. Jack turned the radio louder as the engine sputtered. The music was rough and clanking. 
something the Anderson brothers would no doubt have enjoyed. The Anderson brothers. To ignore it, Wake was finally within his reach. Heck yeah, we're gonna go get the guy. That's the name of this chapter. Get the guy. The dark presence would be on me in a moment. Gotta go. To find a way out. Shoot. Ah. 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 Open the lock. It's hurting me. He's all scared. Can't open a lock like regular. Hey, I need a light, y'all. Okay. Escape. Let's go. Al, do not let your cardi... Shoot. I See, if you had better cardio, you could have made that. Out of my way. Well, you need a light. All right, grab... Oh, no. All the lights are going away. There's a light, though. Hey, stay in this light. Shoot. Oh, we gotta go get that generator upstairs. Let's roll. You think you're good? I got a generator. I remember. Recall memory, that's what they call that. Oh shoot. See you later, possessed furniture. Yeah, right. Alright, roll. Oh no, you're getting hurt. Ah! Oh no! Okay. At least there's a flare. Go, go. Alright, alright. Al, Al, you gotta get out of here, dude. Do we? I bet we gotta use the flare. I don't wanna waste this flare! Okay. Let's go. Let's go out. This is rad. Go out. Oh no. The, just go through the window, Al. Al. Be, work smarter, not harder. I don't have any more flare. Well, that'll work. Okay, thank you, giant ball of possession. The ball of possession is really kind of tr trouble. The ball of possession is making me mad. Okay, hold on, hold on. Ah! Cool. I'm glad uh, that's happening. Okay. It's gotta be over here, right? Okay. Go. Why would that hurt me? Go, go, go. Okay. All right, I got an idea. Come over here, ball. Ah! I am not good at dodging. Ah! Are you serious? Go, Al! Go! Go! Man, I am the smartest Al player ever. Barry, I'm hurt, sir. Why don't I just climb the gate? Give me this. Give it to me. Thank you, Barry. Maybe you ain't so bad. Oh no, too scary. Ah! Go, 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 go. 
I, this all needs to chill for a moment. Where are you? Okay, give me these batteries, these flares. Let me see something one moment. We don't have enough ammo here. Okay, shoot. I'm gonna get lost in this thing. Make sure we got all of everything we can get. Manuscript pages, thermoses? No? All right, let's roll. One more time. Guys, the new Bleak album has got me very, very excited. Barry, don't you make demands of me. Good thing this game is linear and will ultimately lead me in the direction I need to go. Shoot. Ah! Always a person behind me. How, how could I fall for that? Pop, pop. Is it linear? I am gonna get lost. All right, this way. I won't go this way. Oh, wait. Oh, no. Owl's not very good. Doesn't. <laughs> Owl doesn't have very good instincts. Okay. What is this? Don't trust anyone. And don't trust Emil. Okay. Good advice. Give me this train. Manuscript page. Manuscript pages are good because. I stared at the Viking paraphernalia that littered the area surrounding an unlikely centerpiece. A full side stage complete with an impressive sound system with all the trimmings, including a dragon. It took what? a special kind of crazy to build something like this in a remote field. Oh, yeah, they were in a band, the huh? Split open we're going to get boom stage show stuff? Lasting. It felt strangely appropriate. Oh, hell yeah, let's roll. Okay. Roll, Al. Al, be careful. I can see the moving around. They're coming for you. Who's coming for me? <laughs> Man. Al's instincts are terrible. Ah! Pop, pop. Make sure I'm all loaded up. Don't go that way, Al. That's not the right way. God. Oh, it's a big dude. They're not giving me nearly enough. Ammo this level. They really gave me cool ammo last time. Shoot! Last level was the cool ammo level. Not this level. All right, get out of here, Al. Manuscripts. Hartman hurried down the corridor. Whoa, I missed that many manuscripts. Awake when he was surely at his most susceptible to therapy. But this was not an ordinary storm. Wake had been riding, and he had woken something up in the depths of the lake. Now, it was coming for him. Hartman had naturally prepared for a situation like this. The idiot brothers would keep Wake distracted while Hartman double-checked everything, just to be sure. Oh. Hartman, <sighs> man. That was the wrong way? I don't know what other way to go. Oh. Go, Al. I heard somebody. Who's talking? You 
you get two bells in the morning and then you'll be Is that a, a Emerson? Hey. You get three bells in the evening. Oh, he's a tough man. Get out of here, Al. Too much. Oh, there's a flare. Okay. Oh my god. Where are they? There they are. All right, birds. I see you. I see you, birds. Oh, I survived the birds without having to get rid of my flare. That's how good at this game I am. All right, what's over here? You know their secret over here. Maybe not. All right. Thought I was super clever. All right, let's roll. Right after we get our stamina back. Go, Al. This place is huge. Paid for by taxpayer money. Shoot! Where are you? Shoot! There's so many of these people. I always need to account for what's behind me, and I am so bad at reloading. There's always somebody behind you. Why don't I not remember that? What was that? Oh. Go. Go, Al. Need more batteries. A moment of solitude with the. For the moment, Barry was just glad he had survived the fall. He had been what separated fall? from Al, and there was no easy way to climb back up. He told himself he'd be okay, okay in the gloomy forest at night. He would just have to wait for a while for Al to find his way down. Barry turned when he heard the heavy footsteps and saw the movement. The man-shaped shadow lunged at him from the bushes, an axe held high. Barry screamed and threw up his hand. The world exploded. Wowee. Okay. Emil made Tom do it. Get these. Eight battery, 42 ammo. I'll take it. Nope. Nope. You all. This uh, getting behind me thing is really... Getting the best of me. Oh, look at this. I am number one Allen player. So they're gonna spawn though. Okay. Let's get out of here, Al.
this way? It feels like the way I came from. This is too... Oh, nope. Sure isn't, because there's a thermos. The drive to collect thermoses is what keeps Al going. All right, seven battery, a manuscript page. We're doing all right. Hartman watched as Wake's features slackened. The man was bullheaded, no doubt. Even lying on the bed, he'd almost broken Hartman's nose the second time. But with a little time, he could break Wake down, give him proper direction. Wake was easily the most promising subject he'd had. Well, since Tom, really. Sleep well, Alan, Hartman whispered with a smile. Let me take care of you. He sniffed hard to clear his throbbing nose, swallowed blood, and barely tasted it. Wowee. Okay, let's go. Oh, is that Barry? Barry, I'm coming. Hold on, I'm just a little winded here. Ow! You're alive! All right, get What's me out of here. You? Can you open this gate? There's too many Maybe. birds up there. Barry. Uh, well, I slammed it shut when the nasty showed up, and the key fits kind of loose in the lock, so uh. Huh. Oh shoot. I'll find it. Don't worry about it. Here we go. That's all right. Look what I got. Wait, are there birds coming too? Oh, there's so many of them coming here. All right, I need them all in front of me. Every Hurry single up, one of Barry. them. I'm on it. I'm on it. All right, y'all come over here now, you see? Barry, you're the worst, dude. Grab the standee. You're headed for the nearest. <laughs> You're now leaving Bright Falls. Come back soon, sign. We're going to the Anderson farm. I knew you were going to say something like that. You know what? You owe me big time for this. When this is through, if we make it, I don't care what anybody says, I'm done with darkness. You're going to buy me a tanning bed as a gift, and I'm going to live in it. All right, here we go. Are we gonna drive? I'm crazy, but that's fine, Barry. <laughs> oh, you got that right, Al. You're barking mad. You are by far the craziest. But maybe that's inevitable when you deal with crazy stuff like this. It helps. This is happening, Barry. Alice, they never had Alice. She's trapped in the darkness at the bottom of the lake, but she's not dead. Al, how can you know that? I know, Barry, I can- Al, I- No, listen, I can bring her back. I can find her. There's something special about this place. The lake, it, it does something to the works of art created here. It makes them come true. But there's a catch. The dark presence, whatever that thing is, twists it. You need to, to write happy ends. stories. That's why all of this is happening. It's using my manuscript to take over everything. Al, I believe you. It happened to Thomas Zane before. It happened to the Andersons. I believe you. Crazy or not, you're not delusional. Weird shit's going down. That's a fact. I'm on board, man. I'm with you. The Andersons knew about it, but they were too far gone to tell me with all the drugs they were on. But they wrote it down. There's a message somewhere at their farm, Barry. We just need to find it. Look out! Ah, shoot.
All right. Well, we're back in the woods. Inevitably. I lost my gun in the crash. <sighs> of course you nowhere did. to be seen. All right. Good thing there's Barry! boxes everywhere to go. Barry! Oh, man, you're okay. Jeez, it's good to 12 hear your voice. or 24th I'm streams? I'm not sure what that is. What Don't worry. Your cutout is fine. 12 or 24th streams? Are you okay? I hit some bushes, didn't get a scratch. There's no way you can climb down though. It's like a sheer wall. Oh, 24 hours? No. <laughs> Too much for me. <laughs> um the longest I've done is like nine, I wanna say. Maybe ten. Maybe ten. Probably nine. Barry, are you alright? I'm good, Al. I'm great. Guess you never messed with anyone from New York City before, huh? Yeah, that's tough. I didn't really think about it or like think it would have been that tough like as a viewer Barry, I was like yeah I'd be fine me, okay? and then when I started streaming so myself I was like I'm man that would be so I'm hard to do I now get why so many streamers rarely do it, Don't worry about it. I'm on the case. or just do them for like now special occasions Rambo. and whatnot this would turn into a disaster if I didn't catch up with Barry Oh, that's cool. I mean, if you have something that presses you through and you actively want to be doing it, if you're going to play Hogwarts a game all the way through anyway, just take breaks. You know what I mean? I just have trouble sitting still for that long. My ADHD go nuts. Ah! We better go up here. I know there's stuff up here. Like a thermos. All worth it for the thermos. Al, you better get out of here. Al, you better go. Your stamina is not good enough. Go, Al. Saved by that light. Where are we going? Just to go get that manuscript page? That's dedication. You see that dedication? Yeah, it, when he you know how it goes. Make sitting slot, still long, Walter hard. Felt relieved. Oblivion was close at hand. Difficult. The brothers wouldn't miss a jar of moonshine or two in the booby hatch. But then he saw the man on the porch, and he knew who it was. Driving for his life and knowing it was useless, he didn't realize he was crying until he couldn't see the road for the tears. All right, Al. Let's roll. Was it worth it? Okay, Al. Is that getting kind of tough, I imagine? Yeah. Too much possessed things. Ah! Get to L Farm. Oh, I don't like birds. Shadows crawled over the gate. I needed a light to destroy them to get through. Turn pull. Heck yeah. Now we'll turn that on. How do I turn it on? It's gotta be up here. Generator. All right, there's the light. There's a manuscript page. Shoot. <laughs> I hate whenever Al has to jump because his jumps are so bad. What's over here though? I hope there'd still be a working generator somewhere around here to power up the old lights by the There gate. is, Al, but you gotta jump, and your jumps are the worst.
All right, Al, jump. <sighs> Agent Nightingale stared at the passed out rider. The man was sleeping off one hell of a night. Nightingale felt a stab of envy at Wake's oblivion, oh. but he had a job to do. He put the gun to Wake's head and almost became a murderer. His hand shook and his throat felt tight and dry. Biting his teeth, he tried again to pull the trigger. He lost the nerve. Wake stirred. Nightingale would have to settle for an arrest. All right, let's roll. Settle in for the, oh, cool. Mini game. Got him. Is there any, anything over here? No, we're without here. Huh? <laughs> Ow, dude. Just get a weapon, I sir. The movement in the woods ahead. Facing the enemy without a weapon was dangerous, but oh. I had no choice. You got a flashlight at least with zero battery. Trust no one in the dark. Good advice. All right. Flashlight, no battery. Oh God, this is gonna suck. God. <sighs> this is stupid. Okay, just go. Go out. Think you're gonna make it you're too exhausted and there's another one ah go out oh my god that was luck <sighs> that was severe luck okay go Just jump down there and a go. The car was driving away from the farm, headed in the same general direction as I was. For all I knew, it was barely Sounds good. caught in the consequences of leaping before looking. Alright, we got a light. Oh, give me that fl heavy flashlight. What we got here? We got a thermos. So we got zero weapons, lithium batteries, switch to heavy, where, okay. All right, we got flashlight. I don't really understand what the heavy duty flashlight and how it differs from the regular one. All right. The car was heading for the cabin up ahead. It wasn't far. If it was Barry, I it's far without a weapon. Say. Okay, so it does take it out. I'm trying to deliver each page to the right time and place. I'm trying to show you how the story goes. Whoa. I had seen glimpses of the light before. I had seen it in my dream. It was a strange spaceman or a diver in a bulky suit. He was the one who'd been placing the pages on my path. Yeah, the spaceman in the diver suit. The dark presence followed the choreography laid out to it in the manuscript, growing stronger and stronger, moving like a storm from one scene of destruction to the next. 
but it was still bound to follow the story and chain to the dark place it came from. When the story reached the end it longed for, it would finally be free. All right, let's get the story. Let's go get the story. All right. Flares are good. What is this? Cool. Sure I'm glad that happened. No, sir. Seats taken. Seats taken. Get to the light. Wow, okay. Good job, Al. What up, Adam S? Saved all of the town. All of it. We got flashlights. We got, we don't have any weapon this low. Oh, we finally got a weapon. All right. Someone had left a gun behind. Now Thank I had a God for that, someone. How's your Saturday? The town is messed up, Adam. I don't know if you went back and watched uh, episode three, but episode three was the really, really, really good. Brothers walked unsteadily away from the clinic. Th episode three was so good. Knowing this episode's pretty cool, return. too. The darkness around them seethed with horrors, but Tor and Odin were unafraid. Their eyes glinted with guile. They knew every secret path, and there was blood on their hands. They it's definitely worth a watch. Before. It was cool. The Taken are filled with darkness. Good advice. Okay. Hell yeah. We got shotgun ammo. We're good to go. Good to go. Let's roll. Yep, my new... Oh, God. My new schedule is going to be Tuesday, Wednesday, and Saturday, Adam. I don't know if I told you that. I, I'm changing it a little bit. Tuesday, Wednesday, Saturday. Tuesday night, Wednesday night, Saturday day, Saturday afternoon. God, why do I keep hitting these things? Oh, cool. I'm glad about that. Okay. Double barrel shotgun. All right. Al, just avoid those things, please. Also, those dudes, too. Oh, there's so many of them. Okay. Oh, God. Come over here. Oh, cool. That was a great shot. Cool. All right. Double barrel shotgun. If your person has more than one encounter with a bear trap, they're going to get... Shoot! There's too many of them. It's a pretty good gun, though. We have three bullets left? Ow, you better just get going, sir. Avoid that. Okay. Just go, sir. Just go. Shoot! Oh, come on. It was a double barrel. That should have taken them both out. Okay, there's too many people for the shotgun ammo that I have. One shotgun ammo. That's not enough. Okay, we gotta... Sir? No, you guys... You guys... Shove off, you hear? Shove off, y'all! Go. I don't need to focus. I know where I'm going. Hello? Anybody here? Oh, that's cool. 
Barry. All right, hold on, Barry. You just chill while I investigate and get some stuff, okay? Right. Be up there in a moment, Barry. Barry. One moment, sir. There's a thermos to be had. Barry. Barry. Stop playing around. Barry, you jokester. The front door was locked. All right. Barry, are you up here playing a joke? No jokesies, okay, Blair? Whoa. Uh, hey. I know you. You were in jail the other day. Yeah, Barry's I just silly. To the farm again. For the moon oh, Barry, you're always joking around. That makes you see. They're, they're not going to miss it. Always there playing the joke to the hilt. Uh, my buddy, Danny. I lost him. Oh, you're not Barry. Gone wrong with him. All you guys look the same. Not him. Anyway, you're a funny dude. Like a real bad Like a rhinestone cowboy. You want me to you want me to spare you? Oh shoot, I'm wearing, wasting my battery. I'm very I was telling uh Bello Adam, and I know it may be blasphemous, but I may be more excited for Alan Wake 2 than I am Spider-Man 2. I know. I know. I know that's blasphemous. But I that's how stoked for Alan Wake 2 I am. I've run through every possible course in my head. If I continue like the Dark Presence wants me to, the story I'm writing won't save Alice. It's a horror story, and it's going to kill her and me and everybody in this town. Accord no according to Hartman, me. Alice is dead. Everything. This is what it's wanted all along. It will be free, unstoppable. It used Alice to get to me, dangled her in front of me to keep me going. It was never going to release her. I'm going to change this. I'll escape. I've written myself into the story. I'm now the protagonist. This feels like a terrible It really story. is. The like way to I'm Alice. very I'll intrigued. Like from what I've been hearing about Alan Wake too, I'm just like this sounds great. The story must stay true for this to work. There have to be victims along the way. Near escapes, cliffhangers. In a horror story, it can't be certain that the hero will succeed or even survive. He almost has to die. I'll write my own escape into the story next. I mean, yeah. but like, come the 20th. Going to be the God, the 20th is a great we'll make day, make it though, now that I'm thinking about it. It all just dawned on me. The 20th is Spider-Man 2 and the new Blink album. Somebody is thinking about me specifically on that day. Somebody wanted to make... Somebody up there is like, what do we want to do to make the best day for Atticus. And they knew what to do. Holy smokes, I just now kind of realized that they both drop on the same day. I know what I'm doing next Friday. I, I'm very excited for Spider-Man. <laughs> I will be very excited when that game drops. Oh no. Yep. Yep, yep, yep. Comes out next Friday. Okay, I got a shotgun here, sir. Oh, I thought I had the shotgun on. Let me guess. Danny, huh? Oh, Danny. Was that Danny? Okay, let's get out of here. Get in that gun, that car. Good distance away. I'd need a car to get there fast. Okay. If Barry wasn't up here, he was probably in trouble down at the farm. For a moment, driving I is felt hard. Bad doubting him. After all, I okay. Hold on. Here's what we need to do. Controls. Why doesn't it do vertical for car driving? This myself, but Barry is Barry. Oh, 
Oh, driving car is bad. It's hard. All right, let's roll, Barry. Let's go get Barry. All right, we got him. Barry. No way, Barry. I don't know that I'm doing this correctly. It's too hard. Oh no. Shoot, we gotta get out. Sir. You know who I am. I'm Al. Shoot! Too much, too much, too much, too much, too much. My God, are you kidding me? Awesome. Super awesome. What's up, kid Elting? Welcome still in. A good distance away. Ah, I don't want to do that again. They're fast. If Barry wasn't All a chapters are awesome. Down the farm. Some are just a For little moment, more difficult I felt than bad others. I'm doubting him. After all, I made it this far myself. This game is Barry, incredible. I was telling Adam and uh Bello, that I may very well be more excited for Alan Wake 2 than I am Spider-Man 2. I'm very excited for Alan Wake 2. But it also just dawned on me that Spider-Man 2 and the new Blink album drop on the same day. And that is a very good day. It's like the heavens are like, how do we make the most Kelly day ever? Sir. Okay. This man's gotta die. All y'all gotta go. You hear? You dig? This man, still doing it. All right, now let's roll. God, this is so rad. All right, y'all leave me alone, you hear? You earned that one, Al. Take a breather. All right. On to the next one. Where does it want us to go? I'm at the farm. Okay. I'd known the brothers used to be some kind of rock stars, but it hadn't really sunk in until I saw the stage. This is so rad. This is so rad. Ow! Run! It's coming! There's too many of them! Now that's dead. 
God damn. I'm so glad you decided to go it alone, Mr. Watson. Shut up and shoot. Alright, we got these guys. Ow! We have to fight them off! I can set off one of the fireworks from here and help you out! I got him. Oh shoot, I don't got him. God, this is tough. Okay. All right. All right. <laughs> I need a flare gun. Just give so me a flare gun. Shut up and shoot. Okay. This would be cooler with a flare gun. Ow! We have to fight them off. I can set off one of the fireworks from here and help you out. Flare gun? Nope. Y'all suck. Okay, 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 chill. Okay, chill, it ain't that serious. All right. Yeah, they don't got me, give me a reflare, a Rick Flair gun. Okay. Don't go after that. Okay. Back up off me, y'all. Back up off me. Y'all chill, you hear? We did it, Barry. You and I, best team ever. And to boot, we got a thermos, dude. Oh shoot, we didn't do it. Okay, hold on. Bar Barry, 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 Barry. Barry, Barry, this is scary. Barry, this dude needs to go away. Barry, Barry, you gotta let him, let me know where they're coming from, Barry. Oh shoot. Did we do it? Y'all stay away now, you hear? Battery? Out of batteries. Too hard. Too hard. Too hard. Much defending strain stage. Okay.
Holy smokes! That was rock and roll. <laughs> that was awesome! Bright Falls, rock and roll capital of America. We hey, did it. I like the, the one I have. I have zero flashlight, Barry. No? Oh, this way. Thanks for showing me the way, Bear. See, bestseller, no reason to worry. Your cutout's good as new, right where I left it. <laughs> Thanks, I'll Bear. You're really starting secure. to grow on me. Yeah, that's been my biggest worry all this time. We need to get this thing moved out of the way. This is as far as I got before they ambushed me. Okay. Okay. I don't want to do freaking... This shouldn't be too bad. I'm hoping. <sighs> Al, your jumps are terrible, dude. I think dude. Alan Wake here has something to say. Uh, what's that, Al? Ooh, I'm Alan Wake. I'm always right about everything. And if I don't get my way, I'll sulk all day long. I'm always intense and moody. It makes me very... <laughs> Serious. Right now, I'm just standing here because I need my best friend Barry to carry me. But that's okay. I can just take him for granted. I think I see what you did there. Yeah, it was pretty good. You want me to do my imitation of Barry Wheeler? No? Thought so. All right, Bear, let's go, sir. This Viking crap, didn't they? Look at all this stuff. They must have done okay for themselves. So how come I never heard of these guys before? And all right, shotgun guy ammo, we're, we're good Ozzy on. Osborne through reality TV. I get these batteries. This is really okay. Four. We're good. Better than what we were at. Oh, and a thermos. We're way better off than where we were. Okay. All right, Barry, shall we climb? You think we got everything we need? All right, let's climb, Barry. You and I, we're in this together. Oh, manuscripts. It's 1976. Madness reigns at the Anderson farm. Contrary to all logic, the headiest ingredient of their moonshine is unfiltered water from Cauldron Lake. The Andersons feel like... The Andersons gods. are awesome. Odin can't stop laughing. He contemplates cutting his eye out. Tor runs across the field, naked, shrieking. Hammer in his hand, trying to catch lightning. Their songs of power. <laughs> Something ancient is stirring in the depths. Coming That's so back. awesome. He did cut his eye out, huh? The Viking boat looked That's imposing, hardcore. almost like a battering ram. All right. There we roll. You know me, Barry. I'm just a thinker. They went all those places. Very good. Okay, what is that noise, though? What did I just unleash? I don't like the sound of whatever that is. Oh, God. Man. 
man. Better get that flashlight on him. I need to remember to reload. I am so bad about remembering to reload. Okay. Ah! Alright. The number one things that I keep forgetting, that they're always behind you, and that you need to reload. Alright. Just get out of here. Sir, I don't got time for you. Oh, he's one of those. I don't have any battery. I think we can make it through here, Al. Do you know what's going on? Good. Where do you want me to go, Barry? This is a dog house. Okay, I think I see. You're lucky I got him, oh. Barry. Watch out for live wires. Check. No! Okay, this is bad. This is real bad. <sighs> Was that a flashbang I had? Light is dangerous, but it's good. That was what that was a flashbang I had. Why? All right, stay in the light. <laughs> that was bad ass. This car's got to go. Zero battery. Zero battery still. All right, Barry, how'd you get above over here? You're in cahoots. You're in cahoots, Barry. Wow, those geezers had quite a production going on. Oh, you know what, Al? If we make it through this alive, I'm going to start representing them. Yep, sell this stuff online, maybe get a reality show going, release a new single. Good luck with that, pal. Hey, you find us a way out of here, okay? I'm gonna take I don't a understand what it's stuff. trying to tell me to look at. The door right. was barred from the other side. I'd have to find another way. Okay. Let's find another way. This way. This way. Right? It's too dark. I can't figure it out. I don't know where I go. I think I figured it out. I think I think I figured it out. I didn't figure it out. When in doubt, kick it out. It's what they always say. 
Be careful, Al. I'll take some shotgun bullets. Still have one flashbang, too. All right. I want this flare. I'm looking pretty good, actually. No, I want the freaking shotgun, please. I wish you were more useful, Barry. I'm not gonna lie. Le Climb. As you regular listeners know, I tend to work through the night, but... Whoa, heavy-duty lantern? I still have zero... Okay, we have four. Oh, that's rad. No, 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 no. Get up here. This thing's gonna drain batteries like no other, though. Okay. I wasn't going to say anything. What you say? We got, you know, Mini game. Things have Oh, I'll take those lithium batteries, all right. Right? <laughs> all right, Barry. I could see the building that had to be the Anderson's home on the other side of the field. It wasn't far now. I wasn't worried about trusting the ramblings of two burned out geriatric wrecks. They had the goods. They sure did. Kick it. When in doubt, kick it out. Oh, look at this. This is so good. Batteries? Batteries. Just give me batteries. Hell yeah, batteries. All right, 10 battery? We're going to have to go all out here, aren't we? Go. Run. Barry, you're on your... Shoot. Good thing I got the superpower light. Dude, superpower light is so badass. Dude, did you see what I just did, dude? You don't want none of this. I ain't afraid of you. I just took out a s combine. You think I'm afraid of you? Yeah, ain't no chance. The nerve. Let's see what you was hiding in here. Oh, let's climb. I don't need this. I took out the thing. All right. Barry, it's safe, sir. Oh, shoot. Look at this. Hell yeah. All right. Action horror. Hell yeah. Wait, where does it want me to go? Open the silo door for Bear. Barry, you're worthless, sir. <sighs> figure anything out on your own, bear. Alright, so I do want to climb. Alright, Barry. You can't figure out how to open a door, sir. Uh, Al? Is that I you had to there, find buddy? a key to get Barry out. Oh, yeah, no. Hang on. I'll try to find a key to get the door open. Kick it. 
Kick it. Hey, what's the hold up? Come on, this place is all dark. Oh, hell yeah. Barry, if you don't shut the hell up, dude. Come on, Al. Open the door already. Seriously, I don't like it in here. All right, hey, Bear. Let's go, man. You're lucky I took out the... Hey, can you open this, Barry? Sometimes I'm inept, too. Thanks, Barry. I think we're going to have to work together to open this gate, Al. It's oh, pretty heavy. God. <laughs> <laughs> Barry, hey, back up off the gate. The the I'll just shoulder we're check it. There. This farm is a crazy place for crazy people. We should feel right at home, then. Uh, he gets, he does some cool things. Like, right now, he's annoying, but, like, I think right before you came in, you missed some Come really on, good Barry moments. Let's Pow! He's, he's, like, hot and cold, man. Alright, shoulder check the door. The oh, no need. I guess we better check the fuse box. Where's a fuse box? Upstairs. Okay. All right. I'm on it, Barry. Oh, this place looks kind of lived in. I thought the Andersons were in the booby hatch. Manuscript page. Again, Alice's screams rang in the stillness of the night. I saw myself run toward the cabin, flashlight in my hand. I followed my past self. I was an out-of-body observer, a time traveler in a crazy drunken dream. This was the beginning. The night Alice had disappeared. The mystery of what had happened during the missing week was about to reveal itself. That's too scary. Oh no. All right, let's do this. What a bellow. Okay, I don't know what I'm doing. I don't know what I'm doing. I'm trying to find a fuse box like that one. All right, we're good. Is this their music? They're badass. All right, Al. Can you hear that, Al? Music? Of course. We need to find where it's coming from. That's the message the Andersons talk about. That's the whole reason we're here. Lady of the Light? Oh, that's gotta be, what's her face? The crazy lamp lady from the town. Cynthia Weaver. Right. This is rad. God, Remedy is so good. Remedy is so good. I'm not going to lie to you. Remedy Remedy is so good. Okay. We need to find Cynthia Weaver. We'll stay here for the night and head back to town as soon as it gets light. Hey Al, lots of hours before dawn. Might as well Barry. get some rest. And by rest, I mean drunk. Come on, Barry, this is... Yeah, what the hell? <laughs> All right. Better s safe wasted. Al, I'm sorry about that. No, seriously, because I, I know we don't get along, but we're gonna find her, right? Even though you're a crazy bastard, I'm gonna stick by you no matter what. That's ever, right. Al. Sure, like a brother. I'm a writer, god damn it. Correct. If I just wanted to, I could write ten books a year. And and they'd be the best books that year. No, and it'd be you amazing. Couldn't. That's right, I couldn't. But I could, because I'm a writer. What? What do they put in this stuff? 
feel like my brain is coming out of my nose. <laughs> I'm gonna get the recipe off those coots and be a, a, a booze millionaire. I just miss a her. A booze millionaire. I just want her here with me. I know, Al. I know. It's gonna be okay. We're gonna make it okay. Look at him. Look at him. Sorry, couple dudes. His old standee. God, this is so good. <laughs> what are we doing? We playing? Checkpoint reached. Alex! Alex! All right, Adam. Thanks for stopping in. Appreciate you. Have a great rest of your Saturday. I'm gonna finish up this chapter. Chapter. And yet, it was more than. And I'm gonna go do my thing too. A suppressed memory unearthed by the Andersons. All good, kid. All thing. I was there. An out-of-body observer. This was the night Alice and I had arrived at Bright Falls. The night Alice had disappeared. I had a chance to find out what had happened. I remembered being surprised to see the cabin dark. Alice, Alice. would have never turned Alice. the lights off. Alice would have never. I remembered thinking I caught a glimpse of her form underwater, sinking into the darkness. Go, Al. Diving after her was the last vague memory I had of that night. After that, the next thing I could remember was waking up behind the wheel of the crash car and finding the first pages of the manuscript. I couldn't find her in all that blackness. I must have thought she drowned. Jagger had Alice, Alice, and so she had me. Alice! Oh, whoa, whoa. I'd been easy prey. Look at the cabin. Is there someone in the window? I don't know. Alice? Is there? Maybe she didn't drown after all. Maybe she's inside. Alice! Yes. You gaslighting me. You gaslighting me. I know what I saw. The dark presence had touched me. She had dug her nails into my brain and used me. Made me her puppet. She must be here somewhere. Maybe upstairs in the study. Alice! Maybe. Yes, that's where she is. You can apologize. Alice! You laugh at the whole thing together and put it behind you. Alice? She's not here. You There's a foolish to freaky think. ass stuffed owl. No, she's dead. She drowned. You messing no, with no, me. No, no, no! It's your fault your wife is dead. You are guilty. All she wanted was to help you right. You killed her. Ah! Oh, hush. There's still hope. Cauldron Lake is a special place. Here, you have the power to change things. She wanted you to write. I will tell you what to do. Better start writing there, Al. You can write her back. The story will come true. And all will be well again. She had Alice, and the manuscript was the ransom for her. Start writing. Mr. Writer. Yes. I'll write. I'll fix it. 
I'll bring her back. No. I wrote it. I remembered it all now. In the dark, I'd written for days, a week, almost a complete manuscript of a novel entitled Departure. Jagger had been my editor, whispering in my ear, making sure that the unfolding story would make her more and more powerful. I thought I was saving Alice. Even with it is the an honest mistake, Al. Head, some part of me had been aware enough to write my escape into the story, to bring a light into the cabin to release me before I could finish, to interrupt the horror story before the ending, where darkness consumed everything and everyone. Zane was weak and far away, but I had written him into the story, and his light had been enough to set me free. It isn't here now. I'm here because it was written. I brought the light to set you free. You must hurry. We'll know I'm here. It will be back soon. It stole the skin of my barber a long time ago. She looks so old. I had woken up, confused and groggy, my mind consumed by darkness and fear. All I could do was to escape. Right. The week spent in the cabin had taken its toll. I was barely conscious and fading fast. Don't get into that car, Al. You're not good. You're not good at that. It had to have cost Zane terribly, thrown him even deeper into whatever dark place he now haunted. But he had managed to weaken the dark presence, kept me safe that night. That's how you did it, Al. I wrote it. It's my fault. That's right, Jim. It's my Joyce, fault. It's your fault, and you're gonna pay for it. Ah, oh, man, the cops got me. Got a prison break, chapter five. There's an altar rod with mystery of Tom Paul. Hell yeah, so rad. Very, very cool. We're getting through. Two chapters remain. That's it. Oh, Bovine? Oh, yeah, because he's at Portland. He's at, uh, no, not Portland. Yeah, Portland. Portland, uh, game hunting. Swat is on. Oh, wait. Clouds is on. Retro Great Tom is on. Oh, I'll be right back. The poet came down to the lake to call out to his dear. When there was no answer, he was overcome with fear. He searched in vain for his treasure lost until soon the night would fall. And only his own echo would wail back as his call. When he swore to bring back his love by stories he'd create Nightmares shifted in their sleep in the darkness of the lake And now to see a love set free You will need the witch's cabin key Find the lady of the light still raving in the night That's how you reshape destiny all right, that was another A plus chapter. Super rad. That was cool. Um, 
That was episode four, To Remain. Episode five and episode six. But Previously he's gonna, on Alan I want to do this. Okay. Under I don't know why it does that. Skip. Got my ref my achievements. I wish I could just exit after the chapter and it makes me go into the new chapter. What up, Frostclaw? How you been, man? This game is so good. Have you played through this, Frostclaw? This game is so good. If you have not, I can't recommend it enough. It's very good. Oh, it's so good. I was telling everybody else, manuscript pages. I, uh, I think I may be more excited for Alan Wake 2 than Spider-Man 2. And that's, and I'm very excited for Spider-Man 2. Oh man, so good. So good, y'all. Um, well, we're going to go into Swata. It's playing Lords of the Fallen. Thank you guys for coming and hanging out. Appreciate you. I will be back on Tuesday. My new days of streaming are Tuesday night, Wednesday night, and Saturday afternoon. So thank you for hanging out. I will see you on Tuesday. Have a great Sunday and Monday. I will see you later.